Hi guys, welcome to another video related to the Galaxy J7 2016 and yes, sorry for the late upload uh, because of some night problems and everything I was unable to upload it and I'm going to shoot today at uh, 9th of May so uh, and some problems my J7 16 was not with me so let's start with the review of the Supernova S8 ROM for the J7 2016 without wasting any more time Let's boot our J7 2016 into TWRP recovery mode by pressing the volume up button, the home button and the power button at the same time. So this team win recovery. I'm using 3.0.2.1. It's easy to flash and ROMs and everything. Uh, I will select uh, first backup your ROM and select everything, select storage, SD card or internal anything and just back up it and now go to wipe direct system data cache to wipe the internal storage after wiping let's go back go to install and here is uh, superoma asset rom and if you also want uh, a boot logo uh, sorry not a boot logo boot animation and i'm using the hexagon boot animation which is very great and awesome looking flash that too that is only optional now the hexagon uh, boot, low, uh, boot animation is not compulsory so backup EFS here and just wait for the ROM to boot up here it says for J710MN but I have tested this on the J700FN for other devices I don't know please test it so that it will be available for everyone I think this is available for everyone it worked on my J700FN2 it is designed for MN and it will work on my FN2 developed by DC Music 3 yes uh, is one of my subscriber and he commented me the link and I gave a review sorry for the very late review because he has already given me I don't know many weeks before and this is the review for it so uh, it's installing and 95, 99 to be installed early yes uh, it also super su uh, rooted rooted with the super su so no need to root it manually this is the boot image patcher so you can also uh, flash those boot anim animations available on the xda thread for both j7 15 and 16 Mm. okay so this is done it's finished installation next and if you want a boot animation too do not reboot here Now let's reboot after the boot animation. So this background is looking great but that is not my table. This is my father's office so that's great. He's giving me the so I think there is someone there. Let's wait till this ROM boots up and now I'm going to show you the yes this is the boot animation zip. So let's wait till the ROM boots up. The ROM has booted up and as you can see we get Dream UX NS. So I think this is the first Dream UX ROM with a proper Dream UX and this is uh, yes the mobile data is working everything is working there is nothing like bugs and we get this asset launcher with this on asset apps the samsung notes is also working here you can see uh, the samsung notes is working can I add note or write memos yeah, add list here the number list you can add so uh, everything is working uh, the dialer earphone dialer contacts messages so all new apps are here the gallery everything is new 
If I get the camera, I have yes, it's fully dream UX with all these mods. Is the Aqua Mod 2 and this filters. So this is the apps and everything. Let's move into settings and see what is the uh, device maintenance and go to the battery. Yes, we get this mid power saving. Is the same similar thing storage available space 9.3 GB. I think something more. I think I have not uh, removed uh, clean the inst internal storage. So some more MB is like 10 GB. Okay, you can add it free. Let's clean the uh, memory and let's see how many we get. So we're getting 870 MB and in my experience I'm getting up to 1 GB like 1, 1 GB 1.1 1 .1 GB sometimes so that is totally great while using this ROM this is a 2 GB model so we can expect this get the new calculator app but without that scale and everything all the new music app asset one create asset launcher really working very great and here are some touch controls for YouTube from settings you use percentage 360 videos so you can disable it yes going to home screen settings you get all these asset settings into these settings okay one more thing it has multi user support the guest you can add many as many users here's the display and we also have the adaptive display working you can see the screen color changing add screen status bar you can have the uh, also have the edge screen working really perfect and very smooth this time see it's very smooth no lag like the real s7 and yes we can add some more and download some more too very great this rom is i was not expecting this great rom now for the s7 but still it's and also the version 2 for this rom is coming early uh, coming very soon so please stay tuned for that guys too I will make that video soon to available okay you have to update the Google Play services I think uh, it's a very old like making of the ROM software info supernova S8 J7 by DC music 3 so yes our developer options are also enabled and general management every same and simple we get here the download booster yes the download booster is also available great so overall this arm is great you can see the voltage working i will show you here the voltage and all is working here's the voltage working the nfc is also working okay uh, let me show you a live example because many people use nfc so this is uh, s5 and here I will show you NFC. Okay, okay. See, you can see this voice. Uh, okay, so <laughs> NFC is also working. Let me keep this aside. Okay, so NFC and everything is working. So no need to worry about NFC or everything. So overall, this ROM is very great. The camera also functions great filters we get this camera and all modes very awesome modes also work perfectly so there is nothing in this rom that wouldn't work so uh, this was the review for the supernova s8 rom for the galaxy j7 2016 and if you like this video please press the like button and if you dislike this video press the dislike button and also comment down the feedback so that i can improve in the future and you will never get the opportunity to dislike my video and also subscribe for more videos and yes comment down for help and queries about this rom and also please test uh, someone test for other versions beside the json10 fn and the json10 mn so that uh, everyone can get the chance to have this rom and yes i was also not sure that this will work on j710 fn but i tried and it worked so please try on other devices and goodbye guys i will see you in the next video